Good morning. Good day to you. Thank you for joining me again on this edition of our Positive Word. God with us. We will never continue to remind ourselves who we have, who we take wherever we go, who comes along with us. We do not need to send any special invite, but God just sticks with us. He's the almighty, omnipresent God who is present in all circumstances, situations that we find ourselves. And he's there to take us through the good times or the bad times. So here is a reminder that God is with us. God with us is not to be taken lightly because when we go through those things we go through that tend to overwhelm us, we must remember who is with us in all of them and watching over us, fighting the battles on our behalf to give us victory. We're told in Matthew chapter 1, verse 23, and his name shall be called, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, which is translated God with us. And they shall call his name Emmanuel, God with us. You know, we are truly blessed to be able to simply call upon God right where we are located and he hears us. God hears. It's a blessing to know that we serve a God who listens, not just listens, he hears us and he responds. I, my heart goes out to all those who have various graven images they speak to. I wonder how they communicate. While other people who do not believe in God through Jesus Christ they must go through, go to particular spots, altars to meet with who they serve or, or they must carry images and statues to have that person with them. We just open our mouths wherever we are or commune with our great God in our hearts and he responds to us right where we are. That's the privilege we've got as children of the Most High God. This is not something too hard. We believe with our hearts. You have to believe, trust in God for this to be true for you. Joshua chapter 1 verse 9 says, Be strong and courageous. Do not be frightened and do not be dismayed. Uh, the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. That when we entertain discouragement, fear, we let the devil think that we are alone but remember always god is with you wherever you go that is something that's powerful we must remember this whenever we're going through anything that seems to shake our faith who would you put your trust in the god who told you that he will never leave nor forsake you or a creature which never speaks to you Rather, you pour and give them all sorts of things, but you, you remain the same. One of the confidence believers in Christ Jesus, one of the things that believers in Christ Jesus have confidence in is the fact that any problem which comes to us can be addressed victoriously because we know that we're not alone. And even if that problem doesn't get solved, we have peace and we take consolation consolation in the fact that God still sticks with us he says God promises in Genesis chapter 28 verse 15 I am with you and will watch over you wherever you go that was was given yes let me read this from the easy to read version uh, just hold on please I am with you. I will take care of you wherever you go. I will bring you back to this land. I will not leave you until I have done what I promised to do for you. Although this promise was originally made with Jacob, we can claim it for ourselves, being part of God's kingdom. God promises to be with us, not leave us. He will go wherever we go until he has done what he promised to do. That's we should take. We have a God who is with us, God with us, born with us, walk with us, talk with us, live with us, go through the fire with us, suffer with us, bring us out safely, 
succeed with and through us. That's fantastic. God is with us. God came down into our mess and he will make all things beautiful in his its time. Dearly beloved, I do not know your situation. I have no idea what you may be going through in your health, in your marriage, in your finance, in your job, your business, um, your family. But God is with you. Take this consolation. He is with us. Whatever God with us means to you, claim it and demonstrate it by faith as you wait for your breakthrough to manifest, my friend. The devil cannot win because we know our place in Christ Jesus. God is with us until the end of the age, no matter what comes our ways. I am so grateful to God because he will never leave nor forsake us. And I hope that you will take consolation in this fact. As we've been reminded today, God with us. I thank you for joining me today. Until I come your way again, it's goodbye for now. God bless you.